Most air compressors are oil lubricated. Oil is used to lubricate parts within the compressor to ensure they work efficiently and to help seal air in them. On the other hand, an oil-free compressor isn't technically oil-free as oil is still used just not in the compression chamber. They'll both perform the same function of compressing air. Today we're going to tell about how to choose between an oil compressor vs an oil-free one. Now let's start the video for better understand. Oil air compressors makes use of oil for the lubrication. This means you have to add in oil and change the oil on a regular basis for the machine to continue functioning. Just the way you change the oil of your gasoline generator to your car. On the other hand, oil-free air compressors does not need to be lubricated with oil. You don't have to change any oil once you start using it. Between an oil lubricated unit and an oil-free one, the oil lubricated air compressors require more maintenance than oil-free air compressors. Just like the oil in your car, the oil in the oil lubricated unit will eventually go bad and will need replacement. That means you have to remove it and replace it with new oil. You will need to carry on continuous routine maintenance when using a compressor with an oil lubricated pump. On the other hand, the oil-free units come with permanent lubrication and does not need to be lubricated again throughout the life of the machine. That's why they require less maintenance. Depending on what you're using the compressed air for, this can be very detrimental to the equipment or tools you're powering with it and the projects you're working on, or it may not affect anything. For instance, if you run a company or workshop where a little bit of oil contamination in the compressed air will not be a huge problem, like an automobile workshop, then making use of an oil lube machine is fine. You can run your air tools like air hammers, impact wrenches, sanders, sandblasters, and ratchets with oil lube units without any problem. On the other hand, if you run a company where any contamination, no matter how minute it is, a serious issue, then going for an oil-free machine is the ideal thing to do. Durability is another important issue when it comes to oil lubed and oil-free air compressors. Oil lube units are obviously more durable than oil-free units, because with oil in the pump and less friction taking place, there's not much wear and tear going on in the machine. If the oil in the machine gets bad, all you have to do is replace it with a new one and you're running like new again. On the other hand, the permanent lubrication with materials like Teflon of oil-free units do wear out over time. Once it wears out, the machine gets louder and louder making more noise until it eventually falls apart. Oil lubricated units are usually more expensive than oil-less machines because there are more working parts in the oil lubricated units. So, if you're a homeowner who needs an air compressor machine for simple DIY projects at home like filling mattresses, car and bicycle tires, then a small oil-free unit is the way to go because it's cheaper and easier to maintain. On the other hand, if you need one for industrial projects like powering pneumatic tools in your dealership or automobile workshop, then going for a heavy-duty oil lubricated one is a better option, based on the amount of usage you hope to get out of the machine. In this case, size is usually the deciding factor rather than cost, so choose the best one that suits your needs. Now it's your turn, which one impresses you the most? Let us know in the comment section below. Also, do share and subscribe to our channel for further video notifications.